It was a bit shocking. It was unnerving to know everything was going into lockdown with an unknown end. And uh, at first I thought it's no big deal because I don't mind being home alone. We were largely unaffected on the farm. But as time went on, we realized you're a lot more affected than you think you are just by the news coming constantly and that sort of thing. I was struggling to do anything meaningful. And so the project kind of started as a kick in the bottom to myself to make something and keep making something. So it started with day one and it just kept going. I decided to challenge myself to do a drawing every day of the pandemic. And at the time, it seemed like it wouldn't necessarily be a long project. <laughs> now it's starting to seem a lot longer. But um, basically, since that day, I have done a little four inch by four inch drawing or painting or some such thing uh, each day. As I started getting feedback from my friends and observers, they started sharing their thoughts with me. They started giving me feedback on what I was doing, and it became a lot more of a conversation with each other about how we were all doing during this pandemic thing and what we could do to support each other. I think all of us as artists need inspiration, and sometimes you struggle when the world is so focused on one thing right now. Um, basically, my take to everybody is to just keep doing it, just keep making something. It doesn't have to be a good thing. It doesn't have to be a big thing. It doesn't have to be deeply meaningful. Just make something. And the more you do that, the more likely you are to make something that is deep and meaningful and useful and calms you and makes it part of the good things in life.